Mm. Hey, mm. that's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Ooh, what's that coming at the end? A little bit of whipped cream. I don't know. Maybe. It's like a pumpkin pie. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. So, thanks to Travis from Kentucky, who sent us several Hong Kong films. Oh, boy. We're going to watch Robo Vampire, which this says is directed by Joe Livingston, but we know is actually directed by Godfrey Ho? Godfrey Ho? You are. We saw him in another movie, or he directed another movie. We watched um, Scorpion Thunderbolt. Which was an incomprehensible mess. It was insane. <laughs> so I'm expecting this to be an incomprehensible mess. Oh, boy. All I know about it is he directed it, and the cover has RoboCop on it. Like, it is RoboCop. It is 100% RoboCop. So I don't know if RoboCop is going to be in this, or if that's just the poster to sell it. I'm, I'm sure this is RoboCop canon. Um, fits in the story, no problem. So I'm hoping we get to see RoboCop fight a vampire. Or he turns into a vampire, or something. Or I, either one's good with me. Let's see what happens. Or probably both. Because let's hope he did the, the Godfrey Ho did like he did in Scorpion Thunderbolt, where he seemingly put two movies together. Mm, uh, okay. Let's All see. Right. Let's see what a kind of insanity. I like it. Thank you, Travis. You're the man. If anybody else wants to send us bad movies, I've got our P.O. box in the description. You send them, maybe we'll watch them. Why? Why? <laughs> Why are snakes flying out of a box? Oh. Oh. What in God's name? What? Is it hopping like a rabbit? It's hopping like a vampire. Wow. Is it a zombie? Oh, yeah, meaty. Wow. That was a big chunk. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, dear Lord. What just happened? Man, if I showed you a Spielberg film or a Godfrey Ho film, mm -hmm. I don't think you could tell the difference. I mean... Shit, you're right. These are some spectacular shades. Whoa. I can't see shit down here. <laughs> it's almost like it's dark. Listen, we must find a way to handle Tom, that goddamn anti-drug agent. Boss, what are your plans then? I've employed a Dallas. He'll train vampires to deal with him. <laughs> train? Did it? Gonna train vampires to deal with anti-drug cops. Yes. Meanwhile, I'll send Tony and Ken over to watch the Dallas vampires. Well, is Robocop actually gonna be in the movie? I, I I hope he is. I'm betting it's just like a shitty looking robot. Oh, oh yeah. That looks nothing like Robocop. I well, but the <clears throat> but the DVD cover had Robocop on it. You're you're right. Yeah. They've never lied to us before. No. Like I don't know why anyone's doing what they're doing in this movie. So those are Vampires just standing there. Do they have like that piece of paper? Is that like a spell keeping them dormant? He set a nice table for himself. Look, he has a banana. He did. Some candles, a chicken in a bowl. Are they robbing this place? Doing a ritual? Is that paper money? Is that just paper? I have a lot of questions. This is some cracked out shit. Is vampire juice a secret ingredient for his restaurant or something? He has a restaurant? Oh, Are wow. those drugs around its neck? Like cocaine bags? I would... I mean, I'm assuming cocaine had a role to play in this. Oh, yeah. I'd say that's correct. Okay. What the f*** are we watching? Oh my god, when you punch them, the cocaine is puffing everywhere. What the hell? How much beer did you bring? Not enough. Fight him with cocaine! Yeah! Oh! Hey! 
They woke up. Uh, thanks for your help. Let me take a look at those drugs. Uh, I was just putting them inside. Hmm. They woke up. This is rice powder. That's why they woke up. Really? Inform boss Cole. You two will be punished for this. Yes. Come on. Rice powder, not coke. Coke apparently keeps them <laughs> unconscious. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is happening? <laughs> Did something go wrong? Or is that what was supposed to happen? Am I really drunk? What? How dare you take my lover's corpse towers and turn him into a vampire beast? Now he is condemned to a living death, and we can never be together in the afterlife. Wow. Standard issue film plot. Yeah. Okay. It'd help if we could see. You think you would understand, but she just WWE'd him. Yes, yeah, she did. Is that the helicopter? <laughs> she is your enemy! Alice, that lady ghost loves him deeply. Let's fulfill our wish. Besides, both of them will be under our council once they're married, right? I'm gonna drink. Get some vampire D. Mm hmm. Get some BD. That was pretty good. Thanks, man. That was pretty good. Thanks. Proud of you. So he's. He's conjuring vampires from his off-screen magical thing. Daytime vampires. Oh! oh. Mr. Neckerchief's in deep shit now. Oh! Not bottle rockets! Oh. Wow. Died in the most extreme way I've ever seen anyone in a movie die ever. Jesus. Oh, we're oh. in a hospital, of course. Someone's not looking good. The plus is... Oh, no, the oh, minus. Oh, he's dead. Oh, man. You don't want to see that minus. It's like the medical stuff in Idi Idiocracy. <laughs> it's like alive, dead, you know, very basic. Wait, you know he's dead. You saw the minus. Yeah. What else do you need to see? Oh! Oh! Oh, dear God. That is a pot on his head. This is the greatest thing I've is ever seen. Is that duct tape around the pot? I... What? That's a jacket. Like spray painted It's so falling apart a little bit. <laughs> Just wailing on that priest, huh? Yeah. <laughs> no, he's a drug, drug dealer priest. guy. Oh! Oh no! Oh. Who is that? Priest's daughter? Whoa! That was a man. That, <laughs> that was a rough rough hit <laughs> <edit> there. <laughs> that wasn't even the same hair color. <laughs> it's just a cigar and a beard. You're nothing but scum. You kill Father Brown and your drug kill millions. Wait, but Father Brown was hiding the drugs, right? Yeah. And as for our flourishing drugs business, all we do is supply an ever-increasing Western demand. As you're no doubt aware, being a narcotics agent. So she's a narcotics agent working for a priest who's dealing drugs. Oh, Kido Chop! Well, that's what you get for trying to fight sitting down. Who do you think you are, Steven Seagal? <laughs> like, who's this guy? He's the new hero now. He's going in to rescue the DEA agent. Which, and this all makes sense, right? The rest of this robot and monsters and... Does this make sense? <sighs> wow. Wow. Oh, he's a terrible shot. Holy crap. 
not, he's not there anymore. Wow. It's not a very smart robot. He probably has a really shitty CPU. Robo Warrior calling headquarters. Soldier is severely wounded off of Highway 309. Send helicopter at once. I wish we got more like Robo Vision. I wish we got actually a lot of things, but mostly Robo Vision. This is madness. Oh, baby. Yeah. Oh, over the top. The tattoo in the photograph. Wow, he's got some good zoom vision on yeah. him. Boom. Huh. That's what I want to do to Dave. Soccer style kick him right in the face. While he's down. Yeah. Just kick out a tooth. Kick out. Spit out. He did definitely kick out, then spit out a tooth. Do you see what this is doing to my brain? This is not good for your brain capacity. This is just... I, oh, wow. I love the... He's walking on sand, but the... I didn't even think about that. The sound that. effects. <laughs> oh! They set a trap. That's a dummy. Just standing there. Is he sinking? Uh... Is he supposed to be on fire? He's sinking. Is okay. he melting? Uh. How is this movie getting harder to comprehend? It's a drug deal. Oh! 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 Well, Robo Warrior's dead. I'm afraid he's short circuited. Short circuited? He's on four tables. I, I don't think you understand what happened. They're gonna sparkle weld him back together. Oh, uh, okay. That's how you light a, yeah, yeah. a welder. Yeah. Oh. Jesus Christ, dude. That looks very scientific. He's super easy to fix, so he that's is. a positive. Whoa. Oh. You're right, man. Peter Weller has nothing uh, yeah. on this guy. Yeah. Oh, oh, you might want to get off that, boys. Uh, watch the suspension unload. <laughs> wow, that almost rolls. <laughs> <laughs> Who are these guys? I don't know. Uh, Hope I don't miss anything important. All right, I'll take notes for you. I'm not gonna understand the movie now. Damn you and your tiny bladder! That's clearly just wait on the end, and they pulled it up the stairs in the reverse. Oh my god! Why are you ruining the movie magic? Sorry. Does Robo Warrior Cop know kung fu? He just seems to be able to take abuse. Uh, a little bit. A little bit. All right, all right. bit. That's in reverse. Is, is he in the coffin? Are they in the coffin? Did we just stop mid-fight or did it resolve itself? Uh, oh, oh! That was a cool stunt. Wow! That was one competently done thing in this movie. I mean, that blew up immediately after they jumped. That's a lot of hair. Almost as much as I have. <laughs> this guy's really enjoying it. He reminds me of the uh, big guy from Indi Indiana Jones. Mm. Oh! 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 <laughs> oh! <laughs> was, that, was that the good guy who won or the bad guy? Uh, it was a guy. That's fair. I'll help you to restore your status again, but first we must get rid of that robo warrior. Huh? Oh no! It's like they conjured him. <clears throat> Drop your weapons in 15 seconds. The fact that his strap is like across his mouth drives me insane. Someone 
Someone made this. Yeah. This was released yeah. somewhere. Uh, I don't know about that. He can fly? He's got rocket shoes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Couldn't you see the rocket in this? Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. A lot of thrust yeah. coming out of those. Yeah. I love how he can't walk quickly, but he can fight quickly. Yeah. Oh, he does know Kung Fu. Let's go. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Now you know he's getting serious. I think he's wearing soccer shin guards. I think he's wearing soccer shin guards across his whole body. I think so. <laughs> On his shoulders. <laughs> I, think, I think everything went down as a soccer shin guard. Like maybe like uh, gold. the big catcher's guards there. Mm-hmm. Is she high? She said. She's falling asleep? Is she dying? Possessed by a demon? Dead? <laughs> that was such an unimportant scene. What is this movie? I have no idea who she is. Oh, the witch oh, is back. The TP witch. Wait, is she um turning on this guy again? It looks like it. She kicking his ass with her dress, her yes. TP. Oh, oh. she just poured yeah. out. Yep, I mean more so. Blinded by the. Did he just scratch her? Yes, he did. Oh, he put a rune on her or something. Okay, she's dead. And then he hits her with a fire extinguisher, and that's a wrap. That's it. Which did. Really? How many times are we going to do this? Okay, so the head vampires... Oh, oh! Oh! I'm back, bitch! But why? He just carved up her chest a little bit. Apparently... Oh! Flamethrower! Who's he burning? The... That's the magician. The cable holding him up's on fire, too. Yeah. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I mean, is that the end? The magician's dead, so... The vampires are not going to be conjured and they're done? And the end is off center, so that that's a good no credits. Oh, no credits. Was Robo Vampire so bad? It's good. I, I, this is going to surprise you, but I, I think this is this is hard for me to categorize. On one hand, I was entertained the entire way through. That's fair. On the other hand, I don't know why. <laughs> or what was going on. The confusion is what's entertaining. Well, I mean, it was nonstop, like, crazy action, goofy dialogue, like, n- crazy, you know, bad editing. All the things we like in a bad movie, they were here. Like, a lot of it. But it, it was so incomprehensible. You know, ultimately, I have to say that if you like bad movies, this this is, this is so bad it's good. And... I, that surprises me because I was watching this whole thing without a really clear understanding which way I was going to go. But, like, there were no lulls. There were no, you know... It's not boring. Part. There was no dialogue because the dialogue was god-awful. And, in fact, you could watch the whole thing on mute and not miss anything. And not you might, understand less. You might understand the story more. Yeah. So, I'll say it's so bad it's good because, you know, of that. It was entertaining. It was bad in all the ways we love bad movies. I... Definitely think this is so bad it's good. If you're a connoisseur of bad films, this is going to be up your alley. This makes no sense. It is one of the worst made movies we've ever seen. I mean, it is pathetic. It's bad. And this is the second movie we've seen by this director. How do we, I, I forget how we reacted or, or what I we... I think it was pretty much the same. We had no idea what was happening, but we enjoyed it because it was insane. Yeah. So, so Robo Vampire, a lot of weird, fun... Turn your brain off, go for the ride, and you'll have a good time. I say try to engage your brain. Really? The most fun for me was trying to understand what in God's name was happening. 
And <laughs> I, I don't think we ever... You didn't get any answers. No. No. So, yeah, I, I dug this. I think we should watch more of this guy's movies. All right. Because I have fun with them. Yeah. Do the old tampon booze. <laughs> <laughs> Soak a tampon vodka <laughs> up the back door, as apparently the college kids do nowadays. I don't know. When I was in college, it was old-fashioned. We just drank it. Yeah, that's how you know you're old. Yeah. Not with the times. You don't put booze up your ass.